A Dragon Ball performance greeted Chief Executive John Lee on his arrival in Chateau Coq to inaugurate the second phase of the opening up of the border town. He said an influx of local visitors will boost its economy. Under phase two, 300 individuals can enter the Chateau Coq frontier closed area with a free tourism closed area permit every day. Another 700 can visit daily by joining tour groups. Numerous cultural events and special food items are of offer to attract visitors. These include boat rides and fish lantern dance performances. Lee said the history, culture and natural geological features of Chateau Coq and nearby outlying islands will lure visitors from all over the world. The first phase took effect last year, but only tour groups could visit. About 34,000 people took advantage and traveled to the area in more than 860 tour groups. Under the second phase, residents can apply for a tourism closed area permit through the police website three working days before the visit on a first-come, first-served basis. Security Chief Chris Tang said since Monday, most slots for the coming weekends and public holidays have been booked. Janice Yu, Cable News.